the t-shirt, a classic part of a man's core wardrobe. In today's video, I'm gonna talk about how you can wear a t-shirt with style. Tip number one, nail the fit. Now, with a lot of other pieces of clothing, you can get it adjusted to fit you properly. Jackets, dress shirts, but with t-shirts, you gotta find the brand that fits you properly. So when you put on a t-shirt, these are the key points you wanna look at. Look at the shoulder points. Right in here, you wanna make sure that it aligns exactly with your shoulders. If it goes down too low, or if it's too tight, you're gonna to wanna to find another brand. Then look in the chest area, and just understand that a medium in one brand is not gonna fit the same as a medium in another. You wanna find a company that's using a model who has a similar build to you. Then look in the torso. If you've got a great body that you've taken care of, you want to make sure that it has the right type of taper. If you have a little bit of weight in the midsection, you want to have something that has a looser fit. Then the length of a t-shirt, you could possibly get that adjusted, but it is something I would try to find a brand that has a length so when you raise your hands up, it actually still covers your midsection. Unless you're going to wear it untucked, then you can go a little bit shorter. Now, the length of the sleeves, you want to pay attention, find what's right for you. If you have a more muscular build, you can go with something shorter. If you have a very thin build, you want to make sure it doesn't flare out and that perhaps it's a bit longer. Tip number two, pay attention to the style. Look for a V. Now, you can wear a crew neck t-shirts and those are classic. They're good to go, but I think so many men could look better with a V neck. Now, I'm not talking about a scoop neck. You don't want something going down here showing a whole bunch of cleavage. What you want is a classic V that's just going to give a nice line here. It's going to help build up the chest, give a very masculine look. All right, bonus tip for dressing up a t-shirt is to have a nice watch. Why? Because think about it, guys. When you've got this entire area of your arm right here that you could, yes, bring in jewelry, and that's what watches are. They're a modern piece of jewelry. Guys, original grain. I've talked about them before. Over a year, I've had this company as a sponsor of mine. I'm proud to have them as a paid sponsor because this is a great conversation piece. Original grain, check these guys out. They take wood, they take steel, and they bring it together in a beautiful watch. And look at their collections. If you haven't seen the Chrono, definitely check out that one of my favorites. Look at the classic. Look at the barrel. Look at the minimalist collection. And gentlemen, this is their new presentation, by the way. Have you seen these boxes? It's beautiful. This would make a great gift. They've got automatic, they've got quartz, they've got tons of options. So again, I've got some extras. Let me know what you, which ones you like down in the comments. And guys, I will link to them down in the description and uh, yeah, go check them out. Great company. Tip number three, go dark. So why not go light? And the white t-shirt is classic. So is the light gray. But both of those remind us of undershirts. Instead, look to go perhaps a black. Go with charcoal gray. Go with navy. You can even expand out to maroons. You can look at a dark olive green. You can go with a true blue. And what we have is something that's going to give you a more monochromatic look because I'm going to transition now into point number four. Wear them with a dark colored pair of jeans. The great thing with a dark colored pair of jeans, the dark colored shirt that I just talked about, is it gives you a monochromatic look. All of a sudden, we're able to look at you up and down, makes you more lean. It actually, if, so if you got a little bit of weight in the midsection, you're a bit of a shorter guy, then this is going to make you look taller. It's going to make you look more trim, and it's just a great overall look. And you can even tuck in the shirt, and it's going to look fine. Tip number five, go with the right fabric. So there's a lot of fabric options out there. If you're going to go with cotton, understand that you're going to have wrinkles. You're going to want to go with a heavier weight cotton. You can also look at merino wool. So merino wool is great because it's not going to have as many wrinkles, but it's also something that you've got to understand it's going to oftentimes be more expensive. Uh, it's going to be odor resistant, but it's a great option as well. Now, synthetic materials, synthetic fabrics in general, oftentimes are perceived as being lower quality, but synthetic materials can be great for resistance of, in a sense, wrinkles. But the issue with synthetics, if they're too, they can look really too sporty and it may not be the type of look you're going for. Tip number six for upgrading a t-shirt is to bring in a vest. Now, I've talked about vests on and off here at Real Men Real Style. Some guys have mixed feelings. It's not something they're used to, but understand that if you have a good build, if you've got larger arms, if you've got a build, good upper body, you're going to be very active. I've seen photographers, I've seen dancers bring in vests to their wardrobe with a t-shirt. This can be a great look, especially if you're going to be active. You're going to be moving around and guys, but pay attention to the cut of the vest. The overall look, it's going to cover up most of the t-shirt, so the you know, t-shirt's not going to be seen. So we're going to see the vest. You want something that's been maybe adjusted to fit you, but that right there can really level up the t-shirt. 
To wrap this up, gentlemen, I want to say try throwing on a jacket. Now, the key here is to go with a jacket color that's similar to the shirt. If you go with that, a little bit more of a monochromatic look, something that's similar, it's going to look better than a high contrast. So, don't try wearing a white shirt with a black jacket. Instead, maybe a blue shirt with a blue jacket. That look right there along with a, you know, the whole monochromatic feel with the darker colored jeans or darker colored trousers is going to give you, I think, a pretty darn good look. All right, gentlemen, so that's it. Let me know what you think in the comments. Quick video. I think that you can have a lot of fun dressing up a t-shirt. It's not going to be for everyone. Some are gonna, they're going to watch this video and say sacrilege. Not something I would ever recommend. However, I think in certain industries, you can really pull it off. And I would love to hear from you guys. Have you ever rocked this look? And check out Original Grade, a great sponsor. I've been proud to have them. And like I said, I've got a lot of extra samples. I want to send some of them your way. So, let me know which one was your favorite of the collections down in the description. Be specific. That way, I can send it your way. Take care, guys. I'll see you in the next video.